Well, it's now been more than a year since FEMA launched its COVID-19 funeral assistance program back in April of 2021. Since then, officials say they have handed out more than $2.5 billion to nearly 400,000 individuals. But here in Indiana, only 8,000 families have been helped, which is less than half the total number of coronavirus deaths. Samantha Johnson is here now with an update, breaking down the numbers with this, Samantha. And it's a situation where, as you said earlier, you might want to try for this. Yeah. Uh, because it, it is money that's out there. There is so much more room for opportunity here, and I actually talked to FEMA officials, and they say they are still seeing a steady increase of applications for funeral assistance, which of course just shows that unfortunately the coronavirus is still with us in our communities at a deadly level. And this is even after 14 months later when the program went into effect. FEMA officials say their biggest challenge now is just reminding people that this money is still out there. It's up to $9,000 per funeral, and the application process is actually over the phone with a FEMA representative who will ask for three things. So information about the person who paid for that funeral, information about the person who died, and then receipts from those funeral payments. And this is a straightforward process. It will take some time. Uh, and while we can't bring their loved ones back or their friends or family back, we can ease the burden of uh, the passing of uh, the people that they've lost. So I want you to take a look at your screen here. We mentioned earlier only 8,000 Hoosier families have been helped by this program. The latest data from FEMA, though, shows that more than 10,000 families have applied. That gives Indiana the smallest percentage of returns compared to some of our neighbors at 75.5%. So I asked them, I said, what about those other 2,000 people and how long can they expect to wait for those payments? And FEMA says, unfortunately, it is so individualized that it's kind of hard to say, but they say by calling and starting that process, you are not taking money away from anyone else. There is plenty to go around. So they say, really, go ahead and call, even if you're not sure you'll qualify. And guys, again, you could get up to $9,000 in assistance there.